On the popular video site YouTube, there exists countless videos called Let's Play, where socially maladjusted individuals talk over footage of themselves playing video games for money. Somewhere in Ohio, one such Let's Player and his wife decided to continue the practice with varying degrees of success on a licensed game for a TV series way outside the typical demographic for this type of video. These are their stories. Lieutenant, how can I help you? We have a potential suspect in the case, but he's... <laughs> Let's just say we don't want to scare him off with our gritty urban vibe. You want to use the... Let's just say even though he's Arab, he's very yellow. That's to say he's a coward. Do you get it at all? No, yeah, because I'm trying to pay attention to what they're saying and also what you're saying. Right. See you again. Likewise. Okay. So. Let's, let's talk with the DA. May I ask why I'm no. here? No. Arab looking. You don't look that Arab. The massive people of Mangle. I'm afraid I'm not familiar. Like, he, he, A, he's very pale, B, he doesn't even have that much of an accent, and he doesn't have a, he doesn't dress traditionally, and that dude says Arab-looking dude? I don't fucking, huh. Yeah, let's talk about your description. Mr. Gondopor, we have an eyewitness who saw someone... No, we didn't! My description? A man of Middle Eastern descent. About your height and build, similar vehicle. Am I wrong? Eastern than Manhattan, Midwest America. Yeah, he, he does not look like Middle Eastern. From Pakistan and Afghanistan, Southeast Asia. I apologize. Perhaps one of your main. So he's off the hook. Yeah. They may have a firmer. Sorry, wrong dude. Racial right. pro racial profiling <laughs> never fucking works. Well, we shouldn't, because and he's very, very sensitive. I mean, right. we just said... We don't want so, to scare him off. Are you, are you Middle Eastern? Like, no, you fucker! Southeast Asia! Oh, jeez, yeah. We okay. don't want to scare him off. Yeah, okay, yeah. Let's keep it easy. We're not accusing him of anything yet. Because he was easily spooked. Yeah. Oh, easily spooked. Didn't want to, yeah, didn't want to scare him off. Yes. yes we want to one. scare him later. And then oh! we want to throw him in jail later! <laughs> ah, yes. It's just right down the list with you. Actually, he's probably innocent. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh. I bet you I know who did it. It's probably a fucking bankroll. Well, the first prostitute that we talked to. That's no. usually like all we. No, she she was person. the one who found it though. That doesn't mean she found she found the money. No, I th no. My suspect goes to bankroll. Bankroll is number one because he's a shady looking motherfucker. What kind of idiot calls himself bankroll? So you're a hedge fund manager, huh? Sounds stressful. The purpose of a hedge fund is to negate risk so as Even though he kind of has the same looking tie as his stupid publisher. stress of the market to day traders and money dealers. Still, with this economy, it's got to put a lot of pressure on you to perform. <laughs> this economy, right. Alright, let's talk about Massa Pequa. Massa Pequa! You live in Brookville, correct? Gold Coast of Long Island, not far from Massapequa. I also have an apartment on the Upper East Side and a home in Pelican Bay, Florida. Do you walk as well? Oh, they should call this guy bankroll. I'm really not a pro. No doubt. He's got he's got some success. Escalade. Well, let's talk about your Escalade. You own a white 2011 Cadillac Escalade, correct? Yes, as do a great many other. That was a brand new car back then. Right. Back. Percent financing comes in very handy around bonus time. Do I believe he owns it? Yeah, yes. he just said he did. Yeah! Well, how stupid was that fucking question? Yeah, widely varying degrees of difficulty for the question. But hey, it means you're taking a lot of twisted turns, so you gotta just pay attention. His accents are just gonna... <laughs> 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 Oh, Are you kidding me? <laughs> That's why my nipples are... That's just as funny. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It's probably All right. the last one. Isn't His admission it? matches Logan's report and the pimp story. Bagoosh. Sure. Oh, this game is. Whoa, wow. Those ever come in I'm having fun. Certainly not. I could hardly take invested golfing in something like that. <laughs> That's why I have the escalator. Harl! Let's talk about Harlem. Have you ever been to West 141st Street in Harlem? Harlem? Whatever would I go to Harlem for? Is there reason to believe Gondopor was in Harlem? Well, sure, because he had the Escalade there, so... Um. But that is... no. 
is there a reason to believe he was there? He just said, why would he? He's, like, so rich, just like everybody else on Wall Street. Why would he need to go to Harlem? Yeah, why would he? We don't have any exits, so let's see. Why would, yeah! Why would anyone in an Escalade want to go to Harlem? So how do you know he's been to Harlem? It's just around the time I've seen the murder. The story there was part of the Huh? What? Okay. There's intuition about the guy on parole. Well, that wouldn't. What? That wouldn't Pip put him. story in their arrest report. That wouldn't put him in Harlem. Well, well the arrest yeah, report. the fucking two, the first two. One of these two. This story entire marks captured at the scene of the murder. I think it's the arrest report. Yes. yes. Oh, they didn't mention a tire report. Right, the I don't remember tracks. that either. Mr. Gondepour, you were arrested for assaulting a prostitute on West 141st Street, less than a year ago. But then again, who hasn't been arrested for assaulting a prostitute? I mean, sometimes they just don't know when to say no. You know, you remember last month? No. No, I don't. <laughs> Please enlighten me. You were there. Ten dollars? Oh, you found a cheap one, didn't you? Car where she threatened to blackmail me with some story of being attacked. The poor girl. I, I wish I could have helped her somehow. Again, mm -hmm. we appreciate your time, Mr. Gandaport. Feel free to call my office should you wish another appointment. Good day. I don't know about you, motherfucker. Yeah, but her eyes like uh uh. Yeah, bankroll's looking more suspicious by the time I think. But then again, she's right. Like, she, like we, he knew it was going to happen. So. Suspect number two. Just number two. Bankroll's still number one, though. I mean, for me, anyway. I have no reason to believe it was bankroll. I do. Because pimps kill their girls all the time. Yeah, but he's also like a stupid fucking pimp. <laughs> Precisely. Uh, how do you know that right off the top of your head? Only licensed professionals can buy it. Control Again, how do you... Because she's smart. That's why she's cheap. Detective Curtis. Good point. Very good point. Benson, you remember the Mickey Trevino case? Mickey yeah, Trevino. Yeah, that was Cormac's caller. Yeah. The gun Trevino was using, he claimed they had found it hidden in the basement of his apartment building. Cormac was able to confirm it. Hmm. Here's a list of residents from 1998 onwards. Maybe you can do something with it. Uh, she's not even looking at the paper. Yeah, whatever, Chief. Jackass. Oh, it's time for the Irishman to get his turn now. Your case has got a whole lot more interesting. Keep me posted. Patty Jackson, you're under arrest. Why? Whoa! Whoa, hold on. You're in violation, Patty. Nah, nah, me and my P.O., we got it all worked out. My uh, probation transfer got messed up, that's all. Well, there's our rust color. The van's got red primer. Hmm. Now we got this patty guy just gift wrap for us right in front of us? Nah, this is too easy. Yeah. Way too easy. Zip ties and duct tape to bind his victims. We found some crystal meth on Wendy. She had a lock of hair taken and she had to be cut. I'm thinking that they used a knife to scare her and then he used it to cut off. We need something more decisive. There should be some blood in the van. All right, it's time to do the crime scene time and look it around. Circle objects and click on the arrows and navigate around. Let's see. See the thing we do. So, church screen continue. We need to find. So, we need to find all those things. Uh, let's see: a blood stain, a burlap sack, duct tape, crystal mm -hmm. meth, whatever that looks like. I've never done crystal meth. I wouldn't know. And zip ties. Is that all? Okay. So let's see here. Zip tie. Zip. What's it? Is that a zip tie? Uh, nope. You can't click on these things. I gotta just circle it. Yeah. See. Oh, that's to search. All right. Don't keep. All right. Hmm. What's this right here? I don't know. Wait. What do the zip ties actually look like? Okay. They're like. Like a case of them or something? 
Okay. I don't know. It looks... Oh, isn't that? They're right there. Oh. Circle that whole thing. Oh, there you, there you fucking go. There you go. All right. Okay, they were in a plastic container. Yeah, that was it. Burlap sack. That's probably what this is. Ah, okay. Yeah. Good enough. Burlap sack. They have entire sacks of that shit? Yeah, it's a pesticide. But you need That's what he's doing. The whole sacks of it though? Alright. Aha! Uh -huh. Blood, Blood stain. Right there. Word of the wise, Patty. You kill a girl in your game, you should worry about cleaning the inside, not painting the outside. But I painted the outside in her blood. I cut myself on a hitch, Jim. Sure you sure did. Sure you did. Sure you fucking did, you lying son of a bitch. Whoa, whoa. Duct tape. Duct tape. We'll see if the end piece matches up with any of the pieces found on Wendy. All right. Now, if I were a crystal meth addict, where would I hide my crack pipe? That is electrical sockets. Oh. Over here, man. What's this box? Oh, yeah. This is interesting. You wear a lot of jewelry, Patty. I made that. I sell them at flea markets and stuff. It's not a restricted item. Yeah, it's not a restricted item. You're not supposed to. What's no, in no, there? no, 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 no! Oh, 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 what? Oh, oh. Well, we're out of magnifying glasses, so I guess uh, we're done here. <laughs> not really. All right. Whoa, looks like crystal meth. You trying to lose weight, Patty? That ain't mine. I'm trying to get some cash. I mean, that ain't mine. It's just in there. I see. You're coming down fast. You don't need to do that. I'll report on Monday. I promise. Save it for the judge. Right. Well, if we didn't get him on the murder, we're gonna get him a crystal meth at least. So either way, you're going away, Patty. Or should I say, meth head? D. Yeah. Okay. Interrogation. Your parole officer says hi. Says he hasn't seen you in over nine months. Wow, nine months again. He's staying somewhere else. Hotel maybe. That's the original guy he was talking about. But again, nine months got brought up. Okay, let's talk about childhood. Who did this to you? You didn't start out this way. I don't know what you're talking about. Somebody made you real angry. Was it your mother? Or older sibling? Who? What do you know about it? I'm mad at the whiskey! What do you know about it? It broke my family apart! Okay, he's not, like, Irish. Well, his name's Patty. So? Whatever. Yeah, I never... That's why you, uh... You killed her, right? Challenge him. Alright. Do it. Detective Logan wants to battle! Detective Correct! Lo Detective Logan sent out Charizard! Oh my god. Patty's coming. Pro probably guilty of something. We don't know why, just something. Jenny said Patty picked up Wendy right before she was killed. Jenny said Patty was Wendy's regular customer. Logan said Wendy was corrected. Connected to. Connected to Ernest. Hmm. Not even mentioned. Probably wrong. I don't remember Jenny saying anything about a Patty. Yeah. Uh, no? Well, that doesn't mean anything. We just know his name now. Fuck! Shit! shit. I'm, I'm gonna break the shit out of you, Patty, you son of a bitch! Oh my gosh! He's got tweaky eyes, that's for sure. Angelica Moore. That's, emp that's empathize, size of eyes. I know how it is. You have desires. Desires turn to fantasies. Fantasies turn to terrible fan fiction. Be satisfied. You feel like your old self again. But only for a little while. I ain't no killer. You're not can a you challenge that? Anybody. You've got a sickness. You, you can take the first step towards getting better by taking responsibility for what you did. Don't talk to me like you're some creep. I ain't stupid. Well, you do crystal meth, so apparently you don't have a lot of intelligent points uh, set in. If you know what I mean. Angelica. All right, let's talk about Angelico Mure. You like how I mispronounce no. everything? I don't give a shit. Angelica Moore never got into your head. 
Can you think why a witness might have seen that happen? I don't know who you're talking about. Oh, yeah? I can prove otherwise. Bitch! Alright, who can expect Patty? Bankroll saw Angelica getting into Patty's van. Van or car? He has a van. But which is it? It's gotta be a van or car. I don't know. What he has a van. <laughs> okay. Goodness. <laughs> we have a witness that saw Angelica Moore get into your van before you painted it. In her blood. I'm still saying that. Painted it in her blood. Oh yeah. Sick bastard. Tell you what. No wait. Angelica wasn't my fault. It wasn't even my idea to pick her up. It was his, honest. Bank rolls. Hmm. Yeah. Let's talk about this. Let's talk about this bank roll. I mean, this accomplice. Daddy, if you had an accomplice, now's the time to tell us. This guy, he had a thing for Angel. Okay. He tried to pick her up once, and something happened. Or maybe it's like some other guy we don't know yet. I don't know. Okay. Maybe it's just a one-time thing. Gave me a or maybe he's the quote-unquote Middle Eastern guy we saw earlier. Uh, you know, actually, it was uh, <laughs> it was in my hotel room, one of those motel motels. I don't even <laughs> know. No, I don't believe him. I don't believe you for a fucking second, you lame pack of shit. <laughs> Jackson's story is full of holes. He's sweating bullets. He hates our. <laughs> Wow. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Damn it! Why did you pick that one? It seemed like the most logical thing. I know cops at Rikers who are your favor. They can make your visit there really uncomfortable. I'm telling the truth. I swear. You said this guy. Don't believe. Oh, letterbox. We're gonna we're gonna drive the nail into him. I already said too much. You tell us who he was right now, and we can work out a deal with the DA. Wait, and we go down alone. All alone. Fall oh, guy. Five foot six, Arab descent. He's not really Arab, though. He's saying he was Southeast Asian. Who is he? Or are right. you so stupid you never even got his name? And even then, he's pale for one of those guys, too. We don't like to be called Arab. Ha 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 It was that motherfucker! Their smartphone is set so far. Well, all right, we got a number one suspect. Yes. All right. Fantastic. That that albino Arab dude's going down. <laughs> <laughs> he's not Arab, he's Pashtun! Sure. <laughs>